呃，在服务台有一位来自德国的朋友，好、哦，带着呃一个台湾的朋友，带着一个来自德国的朋友，呃，很紧张的问我们说，他可不可以上台讲讲话？那主要是要讲一些对台湾的想法，因为他很喜欢台湾。那我们想了一下，郑南榕先生争取到的就是言论自由，这是他最经典的。那既然今天是我主张演唱会，我们没有理由不让这位外国的朋友上台，应该是这样吧？好，那让我们欢迎来自德国的朋友莎莎，还有他的会帮我们做翻译的台湾朋友小鱼，谢谢大家。那接下来，请大家留的，因为我们后面一个是在英国很知名的饶舌团体的 Lazy Habits 的主唱。那他的演唱，我下午看他彩排的时候，我觉得超屌，所以请大家就是拭目以待这样子。OK， I just want to explain why I stay in Taiwan。呃，他只是想要说解释他为什么现在会一直待在台湾。And so far, why many foreigners? Or all the foreigners stay in Taiwan and not in other countries. 还有就是为什么那么多其他的外国人至今也是一直在台湾，并不是在其他的国家。And my point is that I have lived in many countries in Asia and I worked in many countries in Asia. 呃，他曾经在很多的亚洲国家住过，还有工作过。I worked in Korea, China. Uh, and I traveled or worked in Vietnam, Thailand, Laos, um, Vietnam, many countries. And I was looking for a place to stay, to stay in future and to build up a life abroad, far away or away from Germany. 哦、oh, ，然后他就是想要找一个地方，让他可以真正的定居下来，然后并且建筑他的未来，然后他想要离开德国这样子。And all the countries have advantages. You can go to Thailand. You have a nice beach, white sand, um, nice food. Many countries are nice. 呃，每个国家都有它的利弊，像是泰国的话，有好的食物、好的沙滩、好的气候之类的。And I never thought about to go to Taiwan. Because I worked in China. I worked in Shenzhen, and it was, I would say, the worst time in my life in Asia ever. And I thought the Taiwanese people are the same like the Chinese people, and it's not worth it to ever to go to Taiwan. So finally, I went to Korea again because it was a nice country, and I had to do a visa run. 之后他就去韩国了，但但是他有一些签证上的问题。And I wanted to go to Japan because I went there all often and I did not want to go to Taiwan. 然后他之后想要去日本，也没有想过来台湾。And in the travel agency, they said it's cheaper to go to Taiwan. 然后旅行社的人跟他讲说，来台湾会比较便宜。So finally, I. Agreed. I went to Taiwan. I just had to stay six hours in Taiwan, and the woman in the travel agency said, "Come on, you are able to survive in Taiwan for six hours." 后来他决定就是来台湾待六个小时，然后旅行社人跟他讲说，其实六小时你是可以待在台湾的，就你可以在这边活六小时。And then I arrived at the airport, and it was the first airport in Asia where no taxi drivers are coming and saying, "Hey, taxi here, taxi there." And it was the first airport where was a serious information desk. 
呃，他来到那个桃园国际机场，然后他是在亚洲的第一个机场，没有计程车司机会一直说，哎、欸，你要不要搭计程车？也没有一个太严肃的服务台。And then I asked the woman, "What can I do for six hours in Taiwan?" And she recommended me to go take a bus to the 101. So finally, I took the bus, and she said to me, "Don't worry. If you don't find the bus back to the airport, you can call me. Here's my phone number." 然后那个小姐就跟他讲说，如果你在这段期间找不到路的话，你可以直接打给我，不要不要担心。So I appreciated the service and I was positively impressed from this first、um, experience. 然后他因为这一次的这个第一次的经验，让他感到非常的开心，然后也开始就是产生好感。Finally, I came to Taiwan again, and after I checked many places to stay. 最后，他还是来到台湾，在他去过各种国家之后。And all the positive things in other places, having a nice beach, having nice food, cheap prices. 他有想过，就是其他国家有好的食物啊，便宜的物价之类。Are not worth to stay there forever. 但他还是觉得那些国家都不值得他活在那边一辈子。I was impressed about the positive thing. The open-mindedness, the friendliness, the honesty, the reliableness, or the um, the education, um, the uh, the free thinking in Taiwan. He thinks Taiwan's uh, people are open-minded, and then there is good education, uh, education, and then uh, reliable, and honest, friendly, supportive, and then there is good education, and then there is good education, and then there is good education. Because here I'm not a foreigner, I'm not an ATM, I'm not a rich guy, I'm a person. And I like in this country that the people fight for the democracy, and for me, this is the reason why I can see a future for myself in this country. 他在这边看到台湾人民正在为民主而奋斗，然后这也是他认为。The only point is, um, I know many foreigners in this country, many English teachers. Many of them hesitate to support this movement or to go to demonstrations because there are the news in the internet. 很多人犹豫到底要不要参加台湾的一些公民行动，因为新闻报道的关系。The people they don't get deported, but they can be written on a blacklist, and when they come back to Taiwan, the government will say you are on a blacklist, you cannot enter our country anymore. 政府会把他们列入黑名单，然后让他们没有办法再回来台湾。This is why we are a mask. This is the reason why I wear a mask. Oh, so he has to wear a mask. But I just want to say I don't want to wear a mask in a free country, and so I want to take it away. And I want I don't want to have fear to demonstrate for democracy. So he now wants to take it away and take it away. He doesn't want to wear a mask in a free country. He wants to take it away and take it away. He doesn't want to wear a mask in a free country. He wants to take it away and take it away. Next week I leave Taiwan for my next visa run, and maybe I cannot come back to Taiwan because maybe the government will not let me in again. But it's worth it to take away the mask and to be free. I want to say I am very thankful that you Taiwanese people are on our planet and your country exists. I lost my hope because in Europe we got our democracy as a present, as a gift, and we did not have to fight for it, and you are fighting for it. Thank you to all.